G'day ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to a new video of Chorchuga Pirates of the New World. This is, I think, episode 4, if I remember correctly, of this playthrough, and we are, we are smashing it. Uh, there is a lot of demand for this game on based on my video, so I thank every single one of you for the support. Thank you for coming, and, you know, I just really appreciate your support, and just love the attention this game's getting, so... I mean, if the demand is there, I'm just going to keep on providing, so let's go. So, in the last video, we got a galleon, as you can see, in all its glory. Look at that, majestic. And we also got promoted to a helmsman. Um, I was hoping that would show me my rank. Um, I'm sure there's a way. Here we go personal so we are helmsmen we have an audacious reputation whatever that means I don't know how we became audacious but the more you know <laughs> and then our wife is Emanuela based in Port-au-Prince we should probably pay her a visit uh, we are hunted by Holland so you know that's always nice and you know Havana which is you know Huey Pedro's uh, native country has the highest uh, population, so we are just kicking goals. And there might be a couple of changes as well, by the way. I've increased the resolution in game. It was 1024 by 768. I've increased it up to 1280 by 1024, and also there's now 60 FPS. So hopefully there are no dramas with uh, what you see on YouTube. It should be all good. I've done a few test runs and it was no worries. So, so yeah, like the screen's a bit smaller. Like, it fits a lot more detail. Like on my end, I can see a lot more detail. It's really nice. And also, I uploaded the OST for this game as well. The soundtrack, I'll link it down in the description and the comments as well. Because this uh, soundtrack is a banger. And I think it should be appreciated by as many people as possible. So, you've been checking out all the all the other videos. You should check out this one because it is the sounds and the music just really sets the tone and the atmosphere. I love it. I'm sure you guys will too. So, without further ado, let's get stuck into it. So, our current objective is the pirate hideout. Well, first, let's see how Emmanuel is doing. There you are again, Huey. Let's see what I have news for you. Trader told me today that there is a huge shortage of food in Georgetown. I think that's an English town, if I remember. Um, a traveler told me today he's looking for a lift to Port of Spain. Hmm. Oh yeah, pirate Charles Vane. Yeah, we are. I think we should do some uh, pirates, because I mean, we've got a galleon, so we could definitely take out, you know, some of the lower ones, we'll get some gold, and have some fun with it, so, then good old Bartholomew Roberts, he's like the boss of the game, pretty much, alright, here's the governor, my dear friend, I'm delighted to see you, likewise governor, you have received a mission, okay, well, let's exit here. Let's see, shall we? Alright, you have received a map with the pirate hideout marked on it. Attack the pirate hideout by the 23rd of August and sink all the pirate ships. Your initial attack must be successful, otherwise you will lose the element of surprise. Okay, so we've got less than a month. So it says we've received a map, so I'm thinking... Okay, yep. Somewhere near Tampico. Hmm. I have to wager a bet. Look at that. Pretty much straight off the bat. Okay. We haven't even discovered Tampico, so we'll head over there now. Alright, no news there. Alright. Oh, what what's that man? His bones. What's this about? Oh, um, Maybe it's a pirate hideout. Like a, another one. Maybe. 
I don't know. But we'll head over, head over this way. We'll see how many pirates there are. G'day pirate, how are you going? I'm just going to press great every time because you never know what news to have. Somehow there are two ships there together. Alright, let's go this way. Oh, Cancun. I want to go there in real life. It just seems amazing. Just the Bahamas in general is just... It's my number one like bucket list item. Like, like the Caribbean and the Bahamas. I just want to go on a cruise. <laughs> okay, here's a bottle. You have found a bottle containing a piece of a treasure map. The map fragment has been added to your lock. Okay, okay. I was going to say, unfortunately, it's overwrote the map we did have, but good thing you can have multiple. Okay, here's Tampico. We'll sail in. It's early August, so we should have time. Anything here of note? Um, barely have any money. Um, Alright, well, there's supposedly pirates around here. Well, let me check the map again. Somewhere near Tampico. Okay. So we need to find like a... Inverse 7. Somewhere in the... Well, I reckon that's it there, actually. Yeah, that's it here. Aha, okay, that worked. Nice, okay. Okay, this is going to be a challenge. Let's go, straight into it. Alright, wind's going this way. Should knock out their sails. Let's go off the wind, and then we'll backtrack around, I reckon. Oh, this music. Oh, I love it. But yeah, definitely check out the video I was talking about with the soundtrack. I'll link it down in the description and the comments. And be sure to let me know what your favourite uh, tracks are as well. I think I might have left my own in the comments. I can't remember. But it would be good to get some engagement down there. See what you guys think. And I love replying to each and every one of you. So, you know, just let me know. But anyway, at the task at hand here... We've got a Galleon and a Carrick, which we are doing very well in uh, dismantling at the moment. He went to go for this sneaky attack there, I'll see what he was doing. Uh, okay, good hit, good hit. Let's stay in front, let's stay in front. Ooh, okay, we're doing very nicely. Let's circle around. I've got no hope at the moment. But I don't want to get too cocky. I'm ahead of myself. Because as you, as you can see, we just got hit. Uh, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, his damage is going down. Okay, we're going 8 knots an hour. I mean, that's the right terminology. Look, I'm Australian, so I'm used to like... No kilometers an hour. So I don't know, you know, what knots are. But I digress, as uh, the great Taz would say. If you know, you know. Alright, let's uh, continue to pummel this galleon here. We've barely lost crew. Let's swim back around here. Oh, look at the speed we're getting. Oh, 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 look at that. Trying to disable their movement, pretty much. But we're just smashing them. Running ring a ring a rosy around him. And I'm assuming there's a lot more pirates as well. Since it's, you know, a hideout. Uh, we'll go around this way. They're barely moving. We'll have time for the damage cannons to heal. Fill up, rather. What am I saying? Heal. <laughs> Alright. Oh, good hits. Good hits. Let's get the anchor. 
so I reckon it'll be time to swoop in for the kill. I'm gonna get the galleon. There we go. Just be instant. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, good hit, good hit. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, they're gonna get me. Yep. Nice. Let's capture. Put on your loot. No. Ah. Oh. That was easy enough then. I thought there would have been like a few rounds of uh, shifts, but. I mean, I'll take it. Um, can you sell? Alright, we'll sell that galleon and this carrick. And we'll repair the one we got. We'll uh, get cannons. Look at the gold we have. Chef's kiss. Beautiful. That's what I say. With a flagon of rum, rum help, Orlando de Vega. Or de Vega. Oh, yes, please, Fernando. Thank you very much. Um, somewhere near New Orleans. Hmm. You can't fit all cannons. Uh, oh, yeah, okay. Um, no dramas. No dramas. Oh, we are swimming in gold. Let's see if any resources here. Hmm, they sell a lot of um, sugar. Cotton. We'll grab a fair few of that, I reckon. Get 60. Get some meat, some spards, and we'll get some cloth. Nice, okay, and we'll sell those. You know what? New Orleans is like right up there, I feel. Yeah. I wanna get this, uh, this treasure. It's definitely in and around there, so let's get up here. There's no, uh, time limit to get back to the governor's, so then we'll take it nice and easy, see if we can find some treasure. Ooh, Corpus Christi, let me go to you, just so I know where you are. So in order to get treasure, I don't know if like, I have to just keep going on the coast, similar to the hideout, or, I mean, I'm guessing. Go a few different directions. Um, okay, well, there's New Orleans. So that in the case may it'll be somewhere back there. Well, that's a nice picturesque setting, isn't it? Um, we have a little look at the map. Ooh, is that, is that the curve? Maybe. Alright. You really want to take me on sloop? It's gonna say, my goodness. Oh, let's get this. Ooh, French buccaneer, Capitaine de Mont. Okay, Chronicle updated. England and Spain are at war from today. Well, that kind of affects me, doesn't it? Um, hmm. There's no treasure so far. Yeah, no, it's not there. Um, I don't think you need all the treasure map to like find the treasure. I'm not sure. If you know, let me know down in the comments. Um, hmm. So we need like a, a tiny curve. Like that. It's either like in that bit there or that bit there, I'd say. No, I don't think it's out in the water either. It's along the coast. Um. Oh, jeez. Or oh, Chronicle updated. There is a famine in the Spanish town of Veracruz. Maybe I can sell them the uh, food and stuff that I bought. New Orleans. Good old America, hey? Eh? Um, yeah, this is tricky. They look for a curve. 
So I think that's too that's too much of a curve. So that's more, you know, gentle, for lack of a better word. This one's more severe. From here, maybe. So I'm guessing this is the way to get the treasure. Or I honestly, don't know. Ugh. I mean, we'll give it another go. Uh, can't get the treasure. Then we'll go to back to a Spanish uh, colony with the uh, governor. Um, yeah, look, it's just. Then we have like one more piece. Hmm. This is gonna annoy me now. <laughs> oh, bugger off. Okay, let's just go. If it was an end of the line, which is I'm pretty sure like a 200 like crew ship, then I don't want to tackle you. I don't want to take you on. There's Cancun again, and there's another pirate ship. Lovely, alright. Chronicle. Outbreak of the Plague. No, you want? Well, here's the Cayman Islands. A well dressed citizen. Antigua. Uh, anything I can sell? I think I bought it for a lot more, so there's no point me doing that. Um, okay, you can actually press on the flag. Let's see what's what. So we're just having water. Alright, so it actually goes into like what they do produce, and then their consumption. So you know what to buy and sell. Very nice. Yeah, our morale is poor, which is uh, not ideal. Speak of the devil, you may have a mutiny on your hands. Uh, don't want that. Let's uh, quickly go to poor the prince here. Quick, quick, quick. Let's get in, let's get in. Before we have a mutiny. Here we go. I've been awaiting you for quite a while. You must come and visit me soon. Leon Martin. I will, buddy. Um, let me just sell off some things here. Um, we'll sell the mate. Cloth. Here we go. And then we'll uh, distribute the booty. Here we go. Let's distribute. The crew members are very happy with their share. You equip food. Nice, okay. Now our morale, they're happy as pigs in mud. Which is what we want. Alright, let's visit the governor. On behalf of my nation, thank you for hunting down these pirates. Here, here are your 30,000 coins. Dollars. In return for 49,000, would you like to buy a letter of mark and help Spain by pursuing our enemy ships? Your reputation in Spain will only improve. Furthermore, your relations with England's allies will not suffer. Okay. Uh, what? <laughs> I have never heard that noise before. Hold on. I love that. Um, I mean, next, then. Alright. I'm guessing this is the actual mission it wants me to do. A plague of locusts has descended upon the sow, severely restricting food production. As we are at war with England, my nation requires you to exacerbate the problems afflicting this town. You are to prevent the town being supplied by traitors. Alright, so we need to go to the sow. And, uh, alright, 
we gotta blockade the town until famine sets in. God, how devious. You have until October 11. Alright, so six weeks pretty much. Attack traders trying to get to the town of Nassau. Once a few attacks have taken place, nobody will dare to put in at the town anymore. Uh, it is also a good idea to buy up the town's food to help you accomplish your mission more quickly. You should expect to be attacked while you are laying siege to Nassau. So you're just sending me on my lonesome to do your dirty work, Governor. Where's the backup, hey? Uh, bad news. Uh, nah, let them get you. You deserve it. <laughs> nah, alright, let's um... Let's we'll see where the sow is. I'm pretty sure it's somewhere up here. Yeah, and there's the sow. Okay. All right, let's uh, get up there. Good thing he paid us thirty thousand for the previous mission. We're going fifteen knots an hour. God damn, no time. All right. We'll get into here. Alright, what's this? Like most towns, this town does not have a governor. That is why no transport convoys from Europe will ever dock in this town to unload luxury goods and pick up goods from the colonies. Consequently, luxury goods are generally scarce and expensive here. However, the colonial goods produced here are reasonably priced. You can take advantage of this situation and conduct trade between governor towns and normal towns. For example, this town currently offers sugar at a very low price and will pay a high price for pottery. Nice to know, but uh, too bad I've been sent on a mission here to uh, buy up all your food. <laughs> the only way to margarita? No, but I wish I had one at the moment. Alright, let's uh, pop their food and stuff, eh? Hey? Um, what was I saying? There's sugar. So, what does that mean in the brackets? Is that. Like the average across the other towns or something. And we'll buy it, I guess. We'll buy their wheat as well. Their rum. Their wood. Timber. We're pretty much buying it up so, you know, people don't have anything to trade for. All right, let's, uh, English Buccaneer, were they? Okay, they weren't going in. Where are you going? Oh, no, no. Ugh. All right. So I just have to attack everyone, don't I? All right, let's go. The wind's going this way. Let's zoom out. There we go. Then we'll just go for damage because we've got like a hundred more, so you know. Bang. Look at that. Let's board, 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 board. Let's get in, let's get in. How are they travelling faster? Oh, you absolute uh, bugger. All right, we're gonna have to like, go like this and then intercept. This is where Pythagoras has to come in handy, hey. Jeez. All right, we're gonna have to take down the sails because this is not working as I intended. We have to slow them down. Is that too far? I feel like it's too far, yep. Oh, they're gonna get away. Aren't they? Well, this is not ideal at all. Jeez Louise. Alright, get away. Hopefully, I mean, that'll work anyway. It'll deter them, I guess. Hopefully, uh, Leon Martinez is happy with me. The governor. Alright, they have a guy. Oh, no, got him. Uh, let me repair. I lost any crew. Got none to get. 
Oh, not. Don't worry. Oh, it's okay. Let me just stay here. Let's intercept anyone. Yep, attacking you, mate. Let's, uh... Okay, wind's going this way. I think I'll know to use a... Uh, that one first. I just thought, you know, being a galleon, you know, would be the fastest one as well. So I guess it'd be too OP, you know, if you just put all eggs in one basket in the galleon. So we'll just dismantle this flute ship. Nice. They're just stuck there. Look at them. We'll sm swing back around this way with the wind. Oh, they're still getting me. Ah. Good job, Huey Pedro. Alright, let's uh, go in for the kill, I reckon. He's uh, very, very vulnerable. Yeah, alright, let's go. Okay, they're gonna try and sail away, but I don't think so. I'm not gonna let you get away, buddy. They're going two knots an hour. We're going eight. Quadruple their speed. Alright, look at this. You ready? Bang. Nice. Let's capture. Oh no, let's get their food too. Um, their cannons as well. Nice. We can still enter that town. Um, let's sell the flute. Get some nice coin. We'll uh, sell. Oh no, we won't sell. Because we can't let them get more goods. And I just realized that uh, I should have kept the ship. Yeah, because we got uh, an overload here of goods. Um, Alright, from now on, no one's coming in. No one's coming in. Alright, I'm attacking you. Uh, another flu ship. Oh, the wind's going this way. Oh, see this music. This song in particular is a banger. Just listen to it. Like, does that not set the tone or what? I've got to tell you what. Look at the detail there. Very nice. Alright, let's go for the kill. One hit. Should be done. Bad shot by me. I should have done a bit better. Alright, here we go. Yeah, you're gone, buddy. Let's capture, Let's see what goods they have. They got dies. Nice. Cannons. If your reputation with a town is so poor that you are forbidden to enter a town's harbour, you can sneak into the town. To do this, moor your ship outside the town and make your way into the town without your ship. However, you cannot enter either the market or the dockyard. I mean, that's fair enough. It's bound to happen, wasn't it? Yeah, we're hostile. Well, let's go and flint. Time to go down. Alright, the wind's going this way. 
but they have a bark, so they're pretty speedy. So we'll use uh, these cannons to take out their sails, restrict their movement, and bang, we'll get them. We'll get her right, actually, and flint. Okay, yep, we're one in front, we're one in front. We got it now. They're speedy little things until their sails get wiped out. Okay, they missed, which is good. We might do one more with these cannons. Then we'll get to the, the big boys. Oh, bang, all right. We'll swing back around. Ah, oh, that did nothing. But they got more damage than us then. We'll go around this way. We'll go with the wind. Circle around. Oh yeah, let's go, let's go, let's go. Instant. Look at that. What's this? You have captured the English Buccaneer and Flint. Do you want to hold him? Oh, there you go, him. Hostage in order to extract a substantial ransom from the nation in whose letter of mark he was. I mean, yeah, I guess. Um, got any goods? No. Okay, so we still have to, um, oh no, they're gonna, oh there, I didn't know if they were gonna go into town or not, it's hard to tell, but again, we are losing a bit of crew, but we should still be right, we'll take on this caravel, they normally have 120 crew, so they're worse than us, so let's go, let's uh... Okay, that got us a bit, that's okay, that's okay. I'm curious to know what uh, this cannon does. I feel like it's for quick attacks, maybe? I'm not sure. Um, swing back around. We'll get one more hit. Oh, good hit, good hit. Then we'll go to the big boy damage. Swing around. Looks like we're going to tip over. <laughs> and we're on fire. Which is nice. Alright, one more hit, one more hit, one more hit. They're gone, they're gone. Let's get perpendicular. There we go. Alright, now we can get them. Where do you think you're going, mate? Where are you going? We're just going around circles now. Gotta look at how much. Uh, bye bye. Capture. Oh, they've got a lot of die. We'll take that. We'll take the cannons, and we'll take the ship too. You are not welcome. Sneak in. We can't do anything anyway. Oh. Captain Ted Shark. We're gonna have to attack, aren't we? Uh, Galleon again. No, we need to repair our ship at some point. Right, the wind's gone straight up. Let's go for the kill. They're going against the wind here, so. Yeah, could have done better there. That was good, that was good. Good. Go okay, keep about half a ship in front is the magic. Is the good distance I found. So we'll maintain that. Oh they're getting the ass a bit. Alright, let's go. Big boy damage. We're gonna have to repair our ship. We're gonna have to go to um, the 
French, I think, because I think we're hostile with uh, England and the Dutch, so, you know, that's not ideal, especially when we're surrounded by both. Oh, well, we're going to have to go the good old uh, flunch. All right, let's go, let's go. Swing around, swing around. Yeah, we'll get them. Look at this. You have captured. Uh, yes. Um, they got none there. Get their cannons. Go. Okay, we're gonna have to quickly just. Goes to the French. Oh no. Oh no 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 Oh no. Say because our ship's damage. Um it's still our fastest, isn't it? Right. Oh of course the wind's going that way. Oh, we're gonna have to go that way and use this cannon here. Uh, this isn't ideal, but we're just gonna have to flee here. We need to repair our ship. Uh, unless we just keep going this way. Yeah, we'll go across the wind here. The galleon will catch up a bit. Can we get them from here? Yes we can, okay. Nice. Oh, we just need them at least the same pace as us. Okay, we're going to be faster, we'll be right. Alright. Then we need to go to Havana. Heal up, then go back to Nassau. Alright, nice. Let's, um... Let's repair everything. We'll sell. We'll sell the flute. And the barks. Uh, can we sell anything here? Since we got a lot. Um... Sell the, uh... The cotton. We bought it for a lot less, so we made a good profit there. And some weed as well. Why not at home? Uh, pirates love their rum. Right, nice. Um, cannons, we'll sell those. Alright, we have replenished everything. Let's go back. Hopefully, like, we're not failing or anything. Uh, when do we have to do it by? Um, yeah, October 11th. We've still got a month, so. G'day, fellow people. Oh, we can't get into the market anymore. G'day, Raphael Van Bergen. Alright. No one's seeming to be coming in at the moment. Let's hope. This sounds evil. Let's hope that famine kicks in, hey? <sighs> okay, they got in there. I don't know what they're gonna do in there. Good day, Raphael again. Alright, let's just maintain position here. No one's coming in, so I guess it's only a matter of time until it kicks in. I mean, the pirates are still in there, which is interesting. I thought that pirate was going to go in there too. Yeah, no one's coming in. So I guess we just got to... Patrol, I guess? We should definitely attack an Annex. Because that's the... Uh, 
aim of this campaign is to annex three towns. And we keep coming across this Raphael. Just keeps going from Andros to Grand Bahama. Is it? <laughs> the pirates are going to get us. So, I mean, I would buy the, um, you know, what crops and what, you know, items they have in the sour, but we're forbidden from uh, entering their market, which is, uh, you know, understandable. Yeah, go on. We'll get the galleon. Alright, let's uh, get the chain shot. Oh, what's this one called? Heavy shot and grape shot. Okay. Okay, so obviously the heavy shot gets heavy damage, right? Alright, let's uh, get this galleon. We'll add it to our, um, our lineup of ships. Well, that was a useless shot. Well done, Huey. Good here on the galleon. Don't want to take me on. Well, they're going to learn their lesson, I'll tell you. They're going to learn their absolute lesson. Never take on Huey Pedro. For you shall learn the hard way. That you are not, not up to snuff. No, not up to standard. You shall fail. Alright, let's... Uh, Swing around here a bit. Pretty sure that um, Bartholomew Roberts, he has like four galleons or something ridiculous. So that'll be a solid five minute battle at least. Um, I'm kind of being corralled at the moment. Um, although their galleon is stuffed, so... Which is good. It's just a, this caravel, which is troublesome a bit. We'll um, try and hit it. We just got the galleon, who got us a bit. That's okay. We just need to swing around enough to get the caravel. So we can easily get the galleon, just waiting to get the grape shot in. Oh, do you reckon just go for it, or... It's hard to tell when to... Transition over. Jeez Louise. Stay in your lane, mate. Stay in your lane. I will go over to the, uh, the grape shot here. We still got room in the corner, so we'll be fine. Oh, good hit, good hit, good hit. All right, let's get this galleon. Then we'll get the caravel. Oh, good hit. Okay, they're trying to take our sails, but I think we've done more damage to them, so we should be fine. How'd they get us? I call bull on that one. Can we get them from here? I reckon we can. Right, nice. One more hit, one more hit, one more hit. I'll swing around. There we go, there we go. Alright, swing back around again. Try not to tip over. Here we go, here we go. Nice. Yeah, we'll take, but... Oh, shit. I pressed the wrong button. <laughs> oh, no. When is famine going to kick in, honestly? There, there we go. I wheeled into existence. A famine has broken out in the cell. Meet one of your nation's governors. Nice. Let's go to... Oh, bugger off. Oh, shit. Yeah, we're hunting now. Um, what do we do? You know, heavy shot. I want to see what it's like. Let me just try and flee, cause 
I just want to try and progress through the missions. Nice. So it does a fair bit of damage, but it seems to take out their cannons a fair bit. Oh yeah, look. We're like immobilizing their um, ship completely. I'm gonna get one more hit in and see if it like just takes it out. Oh, okay, nice. Okay, I want to have some fun here. I want to knock out. Oh, they're fleeing. No. Oh, I thought they were. Hmm. Okay. Okay, where are you going? You going this way? Oh, you missed. Sucked in, buddy. What are you missing again? Alright, two more hits. I reckon they're gone for. Oh. Get another shot in. You ready? Oh, we can do better. We need to get a bit closer. That's why. Alright, now let's... um. Just one more hit and they're gone. Oh. <laughs> oh, I was meant to go over there. Oh, well. Alright, good. We... We essentially killed them, really. Um, so now, uh, we're murderers, which is, uh... It was bound to happen, let's be real. Um, <laughs> the Seven Seas are a savage place. Um, let's uh, repair... And we'll see how, what the governor has to say. Helmsman Huey Pedro, I finally got to meet you. My nation th thinks very highly of you, so I was looking forward to meeting you myself. Thank you very much. You have caused a famine in the South, so thank you on behalf of my nation too. Um, Alright, what's this? We've got another mission. My nation has asked me to entrust you with the following mission. Once again, we are being increasingly troubled by pirates and are losing more and more gold and goods as a result of attacks on their, on their convoys. My nation therefore beseeches you to help us to do something about these pirates. You are to eliminate three pirates within the next 50 days. Are you game? Really, Governor? I know we only just met, but you're asking Huey Pedro if, if I am game. Absolutely. <laughs> All right, let's uh, we got like two maps to destroy uh, a few pirates. Easy peasy. Let's um, let's sell the um caravel. Let's distribute the booty after we sell. Oh, is this like a life hack? Hold on. If I sell all the cannons. Oh, one more about those. Then distribute. Oh, I keep doing the wrong one. Nice, 231. Nice, okay. Yep, and it goes up. Very good, very good. Alright, we've got to pursue pirates. They're pursuing us. I actually want to take on this one. Because you are easy. I don't want something nice and uh, cruisy. Shall we say? Hmm. I think we'll go gripe shot. Oh no, frigates. Take out their sails. Why not? Alright, let's see how we go here. Barely did anything, but. Oh, how cute. The brig. Took out one crew, mate. Rest in peace. You did Huey a good service. We thank you. Alright, let's, uh... Let's be real, it's a frigate. That's the only somewhat of an issue. 
which we all know is not an issue. Let's do one more here. We'll swing around, we'll get grape shot in. Then after a couple hits, we'll swoop in and uh, take their ships. Bob's your uncle, let's go. Are you ready? Bang. Good hit, good hit, good hit. Now we're all going like snails at the moment. All right, let's go, let's get this brig. Let's go, let's go. Nice, okay, let's uh, take all your cannons, which I think happens anyway when you oh, drag them over. All right, oh, that's an elite fleet, I must say. Oh, okay, the Chronicle. Got how many famines? There is a famine in the French town of Port St. Joe. Not ideal, is it? Let's repair, let's sell the frigate and the brig. And morale is still very high, so we're all sorted there. Alright, let's uh oh, all the cannons, yep, yep, yep. Alright. Come on, pirates. Where are you? <laughs> let's go. Ah, <laughs> uh, This is fun. Let's go. We can just straight up just anchor them, I reckon. Let's go for it. We'll get one here then. Have some first. Yep, there we go. They're gone. Look at the size difference. This absolute brute of a galleon against this uh, minute sloop. Look at the pirates go. It's actually doing going a bit fast, but we'll catch up to them. We're going seven knots, they're going six. There we go, there we go. We'll capture. Go back to Havana. We'll repair and we'll sell. Nice. Um very cheap weight. Very cheap wood as well. Oh, I can't fit all the cannons. Alright, there's one more pirate. Preferably not a galleon. No, unless I want to sell. Well, here we go. Another sloop. Let's uh go straight for the kill. We're doing a lot of battles this episode, which is good. Oh, that's a lot of damage. Oh, sneaky buggers. How fast are they going? All right, we're gonna have to gonna have to outpace them here. Take out their sails. Trying to be sneaky and get away. Oh, I didn't get him. Come on. Right, there we go, there we go. Oh, you want to go back into the wind, do you? Do you not realise I am a 160 crew galleon? Don't think you do, do you? Look at this. Absolute demolition. Nice! You have defeated all three pirates and accomplished the mission issued by Spain. Report back to one of the nation's governors and claim your reward. Oh, bugger off. Let's go here. A warning shot in the case you are not welcome. I want to sneak in. So I want to get rid of the pirates. That's a tactic you can use. If they're right on your tail, just go into any town, get rid of them. Repair. Alright. 
On behalf of my nation, thank you for eliminating all the pirates. Here's your reward, $60,000. Very nice. All right, what's this? England has sent military convoys to patrol our waters. We may have ascertained the position of a convoy led by the buccaneer named Timothy Roberts. My nation orders you to ambush this convoy. Of course, his name is Timothy. That's such an English name, Timothy. Alright, so Spain orders you to ambush Timothy Roberts, the Buccaneers, military convoy. It is somewhere on the direct route between Cat Island and Georgetown. Report back to a governor of Spain by the 30th of October. I'm going to go there 25 days, which is not a long time. We'll sail this sloop. I like saying that. Sloop. Alright, let's... um. No, we'll keep the gold. Um, the music just come out, by the way. We'll save, because I forgot to actually. Save on the Huey place, nice. Double check. Yep, 752 to 752, nice. Um, you know what? I might end the video here, actually. We've got up to a fair bit this episode. I mean, we got rid of a lot of pirates. We are, we're still a helmsman, but we are getting to the next level, which I have no idea what that is. Uh, we still haven't annexed any towns, but once we continue doing more missions and missions, we'll do that in no time. Oh, this music, it's awesome. Um, speaking of music, uh, I mean, if you made it this far, one, you're a champion. Thank you very much. Two, please check out the original soundtrack video I upload for this game. Linked in the description and the comments. Be sure to check it out. Engage, and we'll have a good discussion about it. Let me know your favorite songs, your jingles, your sounds. You name it, go for it. But anyway, thank you very much for joining Huey Plays and Huey Pedro on this journey. Next video we shall get this Timothy Roberts and annihilate him, destroy him, and uh, do our bit for the Spanish governors. But without further ado, thank you again, and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers. Have a good one.